Hello guys, this is Moss Gaming and Everything, and today I'm going to show you how to make your DLC games playable without the need of React PSN. Well, the first thing you want to do is to download Brute Force EDAT K License and True Ancestor EDAT Rebuilder. The links will be in the description. You're going to need three things: um, an eboot of your of your um, PlayStation 3 game. And uh, a DLC and a wrap file. When you have downloaded the DLC, you want to extract it and get the EDAT file. As you can see here, I am using Battle Free, ba Battlefield, sorry, Battlefield Free uh, Online Pass. I'm going to decrypt, decrypt it, so I won't be, so I won't be using um, React PSN anymore. Well, um, you want to copy your uh, EDAT to Brute Force EDAT Kill License and your eboot to the same folder as well, and then put your wrap, fold, uh, wrap file inside this wrap folder. Then run brute force edat. Just click on start, and there you go. Key found BF3 and so on. Just copy it. There you go. Go, and then um, go to True Ancestry edat rip folder. I've extracted um, the files and put them inside this folder. Which I've called EDAT. I go inside, put your EDAT file from the DLC inside this folder and the wrap file inside this folder. Now, what you want to do is you want to run the EDAT rebuilder. Oops. And here are the options. You want to press free, fast rebuild EDAT. Free, press enter, and EDAT file list. It will display all the EDAT files you have in the EDAT folder. This is the one we want to decrypt. Just press one, enter EDAT file number, it's number one. Yes, now we need to insert the K, K license. Just paste it in. Rebuild file package that that successfully. Press any key to continue. And that's it. It's done. I'm going inside the EDAT folder. And as you can see, there are three files. This is the one, this is the new one that we're going to use. And this is the one, uh, this is a backup of the original one. So this is the one we're going to use. I'm just going to rename it .edat, just like that. Now you want to go to your PlayStation 3 Multiman uh, Manager. And then you want to um, copy it inside the DLC folder. And that's it. Then it will be working. I've I've tried it myself, and it works. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.